Okay, so I'm back. I decided to let you have two videos today because um, I'm going on a little bit with the froggies because I like them. And so I've got another piece of scrapbooking paper and I'm folding it up this way and it's going to be like a, I'm thinking it's going to be a pocket. I could decide, I could change my mind. But what I've done here is I put a little piece of Steffi's um, border that in the new kits that we have that I'd sprayed with tea. And then I've just put a little bit of book page. I will cover that bit there if I decide to have it as a flip down. Because it could, it could be a pocket in a journal and then flip down like that. And I could put tea dyed paper there or something to write on. So I could decide to do that. We'll just see. I don't want to make this a really long video because the other one was long enough. I kind of like that there. Or I might put that there. Just using up my bits. And we're still in the frog theme. Yes, so sometimes, ladies, if I get my videos done early, then I've got time to keep on keeping on and, um, and do two. So I don't want this one to be too long. Just a minute. Let me get my timer. I might put... Oh, it's going again. Just a minute. I'm going to put it on 30 minutes. Okay, I don't want to be more than 30 minutes. Right, so what froggy are we going to put on the front here? Um, I also had a few ideas for ta tags for the other one, so we might get those done as well. I've got this nice big fella. I found my scissors. They were in my basket, my other basket, where I've got the stuff out that I still have to cut. Here. Oh, I really do like frogs. I might have to, you know, have a permanent um, collection of frogs. I'm looking forward to your video, Sarah, after you show me what you might do. Can't wait to see it. Okay. that Oh, yes, that frog's going to go right there in pride of place. And I think I might need a little bit of book page under there. I just might. So you know how it is. So if I put that one, no, I don't want it. Maybe it's too big. Let's just try. Maybe just a little piece. There. Yes, that's where I did want to cover up that. That's what was bothering me. So what is it about the frogs that I like? Well, I think I like how they can be so colourful too. I think I enjoy that aspect of them. And we'll glue this froggy down. I'm going to be too busy on this one. But as I had all these frogs printed up, I thought I might as well make a few things. There you go. You can go there. Now, talking to the frog. I'm talking to the frog. This is not a good sign. Okay, what I'm looking for, I know I had a couple of other little images of frogs. Do I want those? No, I don't want any more frogs here. I don't think I'm going to have a label there. Much to Sherry's delight, I'm putting a label. Oh, a little bit of book page, maybe? Maybe, maybe not. Okay. Vegetation. That could work. I really do go through these labels. Oh, here's a blue one. Do you want blue? Maybe. Really go through them. I love them. Botanical. Could be good. OK, 
Okay, let's see. I think I, I might like the green. I'm just going to cut these ones out, much to your delight. Because I can tell better whether I like them or not. So there's that one's more subtle. That one stands out more. I think I like the brown. This is how I this is how I decide. I I I try to one after the other, and then I keep which one I prefer. Then I bring the next one along, and then I keep which one I prefer, and so on until I've gone through all of my options that I've pulled out. So that's the blue, and this is the other one. I still like that one. Well, I think I'll just stick with the botanical one then because the other one was brown anyway and I like this shape. Okay, botanical. So that is that. Now, I need to decide, do I want this to be stitched down here and it's a pocket and I would put... And I would put that behind. I'd have to put that behind it. I don't think it would fit in height-wise. No, it would slip. You have to slip behind this one. In a journal, it would go in like that, which I really like. So actually, I've decided, in playing around with it, I have now decided it's going to be somewhere that you write. So I think I'm just going to grab some of this. I'm going to rip it, ruler. I'm going to rip it. What I think I might do, we've got quite a nice big space here. Um, I might decorate that. I'm going to put this there. I'm going to glue this down. I need a new piece of paper. I think I like that side. No, I like that side more. Okay, so I've got to get glue everywhere. Oh, I nearly finished another glue. So what I'll do on Instagram is I'll photograph um, separately part one and part two I think so then you can oh no look I'll just um, put them so you can scroll through them it's a little bit crooked as per usual so let's rip this off up here and start down there I think okay that's that one That will fold there and so you'll be able to write there okay good and then down here I'm going to decorate it a little bit I'll put that there if I did a bit of stamping now. Let's see what um I've got this frog. Oh that's a bit of a funny frog. I've got this frog here. Yeah. I need to put something there. I'm not happy with that colour. I quite like that. I think I'll put that there. Just gonna tear it down. I'll hang it all over. Oh, yeah, I'll put it like that. I 
like so. And then I'm going to glue, I think this one or that one. No, this one. See, I've nearly used all the frogs. Okay. Oh, wait, I've got that frog. Oh, maybe I like that one. No, that one can go on something else. Put the froggy there. And, oh, look what I can see right there. I think I'll put that down, probably there. So that's all for writing there. Um, just let me see in my stickers. No, I was thinking I might like to stick. Just see a little teeny tiny butterfly. Oh, it's so great having them, even though I've still got more to sort out. Um, having the stickers, I think I might put that up there. Just a little butterfly up there to carry on our theme. So this would be stitched down here to here on a, journal, on a journaling page. Um, and I think I'll round these corners to match the top. Okay. And then you would flip it down and write. How cool is that? I really like that. I'm really happy with that. So that's done. That one's done. Okay, good. Now, I need to make a little tag here. And I was thinking I'm going to... I may try and do a little bit of stamping. Um this piece here. I think I'll put that there. Oh, that's not my glue book. Oh, Lulu, can I ask you a favour? Yeah. Could you just carefully open the drawer there? Be very careful, the glue drawer, because things fall on your head if you open it too vigorously. What do I have to get? Um, one of the red glues. I think I've got another red glue in there. I do great yes. thank you yeah, thanking you better. yeah that could it that uh, it that uh, up the top falls on your head okay you don't want that to happen okay so i need to do i want to do a little bit of stamping here but i don't want it to be i don't think i want it to be too bright just a little bit and there and there okay right and now of course we're going to have a, a frog and i've got this frog that frog is going to go on there i made a little bit of a mess there which is so typical isn't it I'll just put a little piece of book page where i'm not happy i'm going to stick a frog on there anyway So this is just one of my um, tags from my um, Easter kit because not everything is not everything in the Easter paper and tag kits were totally Easter. They could be used for other things, or they can be used for other things. I'm going to put that down there. I don't want to chop his little foot off. There we go. And then again, it's going to have. A little Tracy label because that's what I like. I just like them. They're just, they're just um, very botanical to me. Not a big one. I don't want to take too long to find one. I don't. 
Oh, I think I'll put that one there. Hey. Yes, Lily. Oh, Is I like it okay? that. Like if I have my video listen without my headphones and I just close my door. Yeah. Okay. You know, I don't even care if you have the door open. It's not bothering me. I'm going to be done soon. Oh, okay. okay. Thank you for asking. Okay, I like that. That's cute. Okay, so let's finish this one up. We'll put. Look, we've got it. Just so happen just so happened to have a strip of um what do you call it tea dyed paper right here so i'm gonna put that on there whoops big blob of glue because i pushed too hard too vigorous oh i think that's so cute I love ironing. I tell you something that I really enjoy is when I iron out the 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 backing um, paper on the back of the tag. I just like that sensation of flattening it out. Okay, let's take that off. Okay, isn't that cute? Cute little frog lay tag there. Now that's going to, you know where that's going to go? That's going to go here. In there, like that. Cute. So that's going to be that one. Now that would just um, clip in into a journal somewhere. Or it could be something that you could send to someone. Whereas this one is going to be a pocket. So it doesn't really need anything. I've got a, ta a label, um, a journaling card to go behind it. Um, I do have a few more frogs here. Um, I don't know. I don't think I'll do any more for now. Oh, I've got this piece floating here. What about if I... Frog could be cute on there, couldn't I? Did have extra printouts of these? I thought these would be nice to, to cut up into. Um, you can make long tags, like narrow tags. Um, yeah, so I've got a few bits left over, but I can play with those another time. So that is it. That's the second video. Um, this is not going to be stitched around because it's going to flip down. It's a flip down, um, but it would be stitched around there into a journal, and then you'd have a pocket behind it and just to be sure I may trim this one down just a tiny bit more just to make sure it fits in there I might make that into something um, and then here we've got this one I've made the little tag to go in there I need to stitch that and I need to back that and stitch that as well so there you go that's my frog theme um, and I will see you again tomorrow probably thank you for watching bye